Guys, this is the closest I've ever been to an Osprey in the wild feeding. This guy has no fear. This is Bagara in Queensland, Australia. Its rugged coastline of volcanic rock and crashing waves is stunning. The open ocean surroundings make for a good food source for coastal birds. It's early afternoon and people are out for a leisurely jog and I decided to take the Nikon Z7 teamed with my Nikon 80-400mm lens via the FTZ2 adapter for a stroll. I just had this little inkling feeling there was some Osprey activity about. And when you see what I found, I was pretty happy I decided to go out. I've been tracking this Osprey. I'm pretty sure it's an Osprey. He's actually just circling around. I'm just gonna try and get some shots here. Excuse the sunglasses, but it is so bright here this afternoon, so I've had to put on some sunnies. Um, this Osprey hangs around this little pool here at Kelly's Beach in Megara. For the last couple of days, I've been watching its type of habits where, and the times of day as well as when it's here. And I missed it by literally a minute. But I think I've got it diving into the water and getting something and flying away. I was actually filming some B-roll. I didn't get any photographs, but I did get some B-roll. Okay, speak of the devil. <laughs> right up here, just like clockwork. I love these Ospreys, they're just so beautiful to watch. And as they say, when it doesn't rain, it pours. Suddenly, I didn't just have one Osprey to photograph, I had two. Oh, you guys are just showing off. Oh my goodness. Oh, two together, just hovering in the wind here. This is amazing. These are my favorite birds. And I've got two of them. They're gonna, they're gonna come down into this water. I'm just gonna try and maneuver for a better position to have two of them. It's just magic, it really is. We've got an incoming tide, so this is the best time for these guys to feed. Okay, he or she was just showing off for me, that's great. But the bird flew right into my frame. I'm just watching this Osprey, it's, it's attacking the incoming tide, it's gone down, I just can't keep up with it. I've been running after it and I just can't keep up with it. It's, it's almost halfway down this coastline now. Hopefully it'll come back. But yeah, I mean, I just love watching these guys hunt. We get a lot of these cormorants as well, flying along this coastline. Oh no, behind me. And it's got something. You can see the fish, it's backlit. You know, it's kind of like it's actually showing off its catch to me. 
it's coming down. This is just amazing. I love these birds. I can't tell what fish it is yet. Uh, this is just so beautiful, it really is. It's just hanging in the wind. This Osprey has found a nice spot on top of this post to have an afternoon snack. Now, is it just me or does it look like this Osprey is using the sharp top edge of this post to scale or maybe tenderize its catch? So this Osprey has landed over here. It's now feeding on its fish. Ooh, it's so it looks like a little brim that it's got in its talons. I'm just going to try and get a little bit closer now. It's going to get a bit of a better background. going to drop this shutter speed down to something like 500th of a second. Ah, oh, great shot where it was just looking up at me there. You know, this fish is still kicking. This angle's here because I like the soft bokeh of the trees in the background. I love the way the Osprey keeps looking up at me. It's obviously the Osprey is just sussing me out, just to make sure I'm not getting too close to comfort. I can't believe how close I am to this Osprey. It was funny with this Osprey, the way it was just looping around me. And it was like, hey, look what I caught, look what I caught. And I was going, yeah, I'll take photographs, I'll take video, thank you very much. Oh, wings up, that's the one. I was at my ACOM and I was thinking, you know, I've been watching these Ospreys and I thought, I'll come down and I'll just see if I can get them because they were here at this time yesterday afternoon. Sure enough, two, <laughs> two turned up. So. That was really great. Great timing. Oh, look at this. In a recent video on my channel, I compared the Nikon Z7 to the Nikon D850 for bird photography. I mentioned how the Z7 was okay for photographing birds that were mainly stationary or hovering in the wind, but I loved using it for video. So that's the thing, you know, I mean, I, I really love using my D850 for bird photography, but the thing that I said in that other video is I love the Z7, the fact that I can just flip over from stills to video and get B-roll for you guys on YouTube. And, you know, this is just magic. I mean, you know, getting an Osprey so close flying over top of me with its, you know, food and its talons. Yeah, this is fantastic. Are you kidding? How close am I? This bird has no fear. You know you're close to nature. You can actually hear the bird eating. You can actually hear it. I might 
uh, move on to the other side of this Osprey where the sun is, see if we can get some shots there. Guys, I think this is probably my favorite session I've ever had of shooting my favorite bird, the Osprey. This has just been such a magical experience. I hope you've enjoyed the video. As I always say, never stop creating and I'll see you next time.